Hey guys, today I decided to gather the coins I think are worth buying during the current market dip. I'll explain why everyone is completely wrong about Ethereum, what's coming for the entire crypto world tomorrow, and why the AI sector is the real gladiator arena. Who is actually the true Satoshi Nakamoto, and how can we make money off this information? This portfolio is definitely going to be useful for you. So make sure to watch the video till the end, hit the like button, and subscribe to the channel. In one of my recent videos, I got a lot of comments about Ethereum. So, I wanted to address those points and try to figure out whether Ethereum is really as bad as people are saying. Honestly, it's hard to understand why people feel so bearish about Ethereum. The turning point for many was the fact that everyone expected massive growth right after the launch of the spot Ethereum ETFs, but that didn't happen. Instead, the price actually dropped lower. And the main issue here is expectations. People thought we'd see a repeat of the Bitcoin ETFs, which showed insane trading volumes in just the first day. However, Ethereum didn't meet those expectations and only recently started to show positive trading volumes for spot Ethereum ETFs. I believe that the current level of distrust and hate toward this blockchain, its founder, and the token itself is a mistake. These low prices are actually a gift for all of us. After all, this blockchain powers all the major DEX exchanges, DeFi was born here, and the entire NFT sector emerged on Ethereum. Plus, its TVL, total value locked, accounts for 55% of all competitors combined. So, I just can't see a scenario where Ethereum doesn't reach new all-time highs during this bull market. In fact, if you're curious, I believe that during this bull cycle, we could see this altcoin in the 7,000 to 9,000 range per Ethereum. Sure, getting a 3 to 4 times return might not sound like the most exciting thing during a bull market, but I view this as a low-risk investment, so I don't think even 3 times is something to scoff at. You can invest a significant amount into this kind of asset. By the way, the blockchain itself might be looking at some solid upgrades, which could shift the narrative. Before we move on, I just want to remind you, this video is not financial advice. I'm just sharing my thoughts, and I'm not forcing them on anyone. You should make your own decisions about which assets to buy. So, definitely do your own research and invest wisely. Three, two, one, fire! Guys, I've done a ton of portfolio reviews and deep dives on individual AI coins. This narrative is incredibly important and trending right now, both in the traditional and crypto markets. In the AI crypto space, we're already seeing some clear leaders emerge, and that's a good thing because we picked up most of them before the big hype. Unfortunately, or fortunately, these leaders have overshadowed other solid coins in this space. But for us, that's the perfect opportunity to grab some equally promising and innovative coins and projects. Today, I want to talk once again about Akash Network a truly high-quality project with an excellent product that's flying under the radar of most DGENs. Essentially, it's a crypto competitor to Google Cloud, Amazon Web Services, and others. The biggest advantage of Akash is that it offers far more competitive pricing for its services. Just take a look at this chart. You'll see they genuinely provide better prices for all kinds of goods and services, which is a major driver of their growth. Plus, their platform operates as a marketplace, meaning you can literally rent out your GPUs and earn passive income from them. They're also working hard to grow their ecosystem, promoting various simplified ways to become part of Akash Network. They've got some solid use cases as well, which of course boosts trust in their project and its potential for future growth. One way or another, the GPU space looks incredibly bullish right now, and leading experts are already saying we're about to witness a parabolic rise in this market. So, I have no doubts about the future growth of this sector, the coins within it, and Akash in particular. Personally, I expect to see at least the recent market cap of Render Network in the short term. There are projects that, for some reason, most people overlook. However, they have insane potential. In my opinion, right now a lot of people are missing out on a really interesting project and blockchain. SEI is a chance to invest in a blockchain whose ecosystem is growing at a crazy pace. It's a layer one blockchain that's often called the younger brother of SUI. 
First, because the names are quite similar, and second, because the technologies are somewhat alike, even though they use different programming languages. Right now, you can see Sui's TVL, total value locked, and the price of its token, which increased as the TVL grew. We're seeing the same thing happen with SEI. Its TVL is skyrocketing, and the asset's price should follow. Even though the blockchain is less than a year old, it already has a large community, and with that community, SEI has built a pretty solid ecosystem. That's exactly why the TVL is rising, and why I'm so interested in this project. But despite all the positive aspects, I have to point out a few downsides too. At the moment, not all of the token's supply is in circulation, but it's important to note that the team has designed a very smart unlocking model that won't allow the price to dump suddenly. So, what do you think about this token? Would you add it to your portfolio? Guys, before we jump into this section, I want to give you a heads up. This part is going to be pretty experimental. Meme coins right now are a great way to make some easy gains. Everyone who followed my portfolios had the chance to make up to 4x on PopCat, which now has a market cap close to $1.5 billion. The same goes for Billy and Smocking Chickenfish, which delivered around 4x in the last month. Today, I'm going to talk about meme coins, but I won't be mentioning PopCat, Weef, or any other coins that have already proven themselves. The focus will be on a fascinating new documentary from HBO, where they promise to reveal the identity of Satoshi Nakamoto. There's already a ton of tokens popping up around this and they're getting massive trading volumes, but the one I'm really into is called Satoshi Revealed, and it references Len Sassaman, who is considered a top candidate to be the founder of cryptocurrency. There are plenty of theories and ideas out there. In my opinion, Len could easily hit a market cap of $15 to $20 million if everything goes well, and HBO names him as the founder. The same can be said for the meme token Sasha, which was the name of the possible Bitcoin founder's cat. You need to understand that this is a total degen play. If these names don't come up in the HBO documentary, both tokens will crash hard. So you need to approach this with caution and be fully aware of the risks. That's all for now. Just a reminder. This video is in no way financial advice. It's just my take and thoughts on the market. So always do your own research before investing and be smart with your money. Hit the like button if you enjoyed the video and make sure to subscribe so you don't miss out on future coin growth. Thanks for watching your coin post.